Hey there, it's me, and we are here again for another modify command, which is the trim and extend. Today, I'm gonna show you how it is used in our drawings. Let's begin. Basically, when we say trim and extend from the words themselves, trim means to cut and extend means to make it longer or lengthen when we are talking about lines. To start with, we have our sample drawings here. From our previous videos, we already discussed about drawing lines and copying objects. Now, if you miss those videos, you can always check it out in our YouTube channel, that's 3D Naomi, and we'll put the links here in the description. Going back to what I'm saying, to draw this figure right here, we need lines. Type in line in our command bar. Or you can just go in our ribbon. Click line. And then we will draw two squares with 100 millimeters each side. I'll start my starting point with 25 comma 25 there you go now next thing we want to do is to draw vertical lines to make the upper half of our figure one so just like what we did in our last video we divide this line by 10. So the command will be divide. Enter. And then click the line. And then enter the number of segments. Type in 10. And then enter. So we have points right here. All we have to do is copy this line going to this point. There you go. Now, as you can see in our figure one, these vertical lines will just go halfway down here. And there goes the trim command. We will use this trim command to cut these vertical lines. First, I'm going to draw a horizontal line here. From this midpoint up to the opposite side. Now, if you are wondering how I locate the midpoint of this line, you can see a green triangular shape when you hover your pointer to the mid area. This is one feature which is the so-called object snap or OSNAP. We'll talk about more of these settings in our future lessons. Now let's go trim. To use this command, first you have to select your trimming plane or line. In this example, we have this line as our trimming line. So select this line and then trim. 
and then hover your pointer to the part which you want to trim. You'll get a preview of the trim, and then to select it, just click your left mouse button, and that's it. Though they changed that a little bit with 2021 versions, wherein you get these options like cutting edges, crossing, and mode. Like here in the mode, we got quick and standard options. The standard version is just like the old version that I explained a while ago. While the quick version is just like wherein I don't have to select the cutting plane that I want to trim to. Just click trim and directly hover over that line you want to trim to. And that's it. And then to complete the drawing, just divide this side by 10. And then copy this line to each point up to halfway. Now let's move on to the extend command. Basically, this extend command is just the opposite of the trim command. Extend command is used to make your lines longer or lengthen to a point or boundary. Just click extend. Select the boundary line. Enter. And then select which line you want to extend. And we also have some changes with the modes just like in the trim command. And that's it. The trim and extend commands. So thank you so much for checking out this video. Hit the like button if this video was helpful. Subscribe for more videos like this. Until next time, bye!